Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be making some black bean and red pepper sausages, so keep watching this video for the rest of the recipe. Start by adding some veggie broth to your skillet, followed by one half of a minced red onion and three garlic cloves. Add one red bell pepper and saute until it starts to get soft. Next, add about a fourth cup of chopped celery. Give it a good mix. Next, add some salt and pepper, savory, cumin, and paprika to taste, but this is roughly the measurements I used. Now add three cups of chopped button mushrooms pre-washed. Once it's well incorporated, let that sit and stew for about five to 10 minutes until the vegetables are super nice and soft. Now we turn to our blender to make an additional base to the wet ingredients of our seitan sausages. Add three cups of black beans to your blender of choice, followed by all of the vegetables that we just cooked on the stove top. Add some Worcestershire sauce, who knows how you pronounce this sauce, but it's delicious, about 1.5 tablespoons worth. Now at this point, you can add any additional spices you'd like, or more of the spices we've already added, but then blend until nice and smooth. For the dry ingredients, we're going to take 3 cups of vital wheat gluten and 1.5 cups of buckwheat flour lightly mix it and then add our wet ingredients to our dry ingredients mix with a wooden spoon and then knead by hand until the dough starts to form a seitan and dough like mixture this normally takes about five to ten minutes Once your mixture comes together, take a knife or a dough utensil and split into eight equal sections. You can weigh them or eyeball them. It really doesn't make too much of a difference, but more or less you want them to be the same amount of grams. Then start to lightly shape the dough sections into sausage cylinders and take eight sheets of aluminum foil lightly grease them with some spray grease and roll each individual sausage in the aluminum foil once your sausages are in the desired shape and you've done it to every single one, we're gonna steam it. As you'll see in just a moment, I steam my sausages in a bamboo steamer over a wok. I'll leave these two items in the description for you to purchase on Amazon or just get an idea of the ones I've used. This is my favorite way to steam. Say tan, it works really well. And also you can steam vegetables and all types of goodies. So once everything is rolled up, steam in your bamboo steamer for 40 minutes, adding about half of the sausages to the bottom and half to the top, 
at about 20 minutes try and move the sausages around so they cook accordingly when you're done let them chill in the foil for about five to ten minutes until you can touch them without burning yourself and release all of the sausages from the aluminum foil now you can store them or eat them in a hot dog bun just like a regular sausage but stay tuned for next week where i'm going to show you guys how to make toad in the hole Thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for next week's video. Subscribe for daily shorts and weekly videos every Friday. Take good care.